Hi everyone, Mayan Yachman here, editor on Heart of Mercy, with part six of our behind the scenes series, Working From Home edition. This episode is all about 3D modeling. So, what is 3D modeling anyway? Well, to put it simply, it's the production of digital objects in three dimensional space. It could be anything you can think of, but a quick illustration here and you get the idea. Visual artists are no longer confined to the up, down, and sideways directions of a video frame. We can now move things on the far and near plane to give objects both depth and volume. That aspect gives things more realism. Additionally, it helps the artist visualize works more dynamically. We've talked about the technique of placing green screen actors into various environments in past episodes. However, there's a limit to that process and the best analogy I can think of is of those tourist photos showing people in front of fake backdrops. What we needed in Heart of Mercy was a way to control the entire shooting environment while conveying a sense of space. The only options were to either film on location which would have added additional challenges like travel, permits, and all of the production costs involved in location shooting or building full-size practical sets in our studio, which wasn't a practical option at all, or building virtual sets that we could control every aspect of the scene, camera angle, lighting, etc., and we could build them as large as we wanted. Whether going for semi-realism like this cottage designed to mimic Faustina's family home or a more artistic rendition of her many chapel visits represented by this single interior build, 3D models afford us the flexibility to manipulate our environments in ways not possible with photo backdrops or even location shooting. One of the key factors in our decision to use 3D models was the ability to render our scenes as artistic expressions, much like paintings in a way, which can be anything from abstract to surreal. It's for this reason that many Hollywood films elect to shoot on green screen and build their worlds inside the computer. It was the best decision we could make because the results, as always, speak for themselves. I'm really blessed to be able to incorporate my many years of 3D modeling that have made a difference in not only the look of Heart of Mercy, but what I'm hoping will be a much more immersive experience for our audience. Your support is showing up in beautiful ways, so thank you and God bless you during this holy season.